Add three numbers, getting the same sum, Lesson 310. When a problem has three add-ends, we can add them in any order. The sum will stay the same. If we add 1 plus 2 plus 3, we can add the 1 plus 2 first. That equals 3. Then we can add that 3. That's doubles, isn't it? It equals 6. We can also add the 2 plus 3 first. That makes a 5. Then we can add the 1. That makes a 6. The sum stays the same. We can change which two add-ends to add first. We can add in any order. If we want to add 5 plus 4 plus 1, we can add the 5 plus 4 first. That's 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Then we can add the 1. That's 10. We can also add the 4 plus 1 first. That equals 5. We'll add these together first to make a 5. Then we can add the other 5. That's a doubles. That equals 10. It's the same sum. If we want to add 3 plus 9 plus 1, we can add the 3 and the 9 together first. That's 9, 10, 11, 12. Then we can add the 1. That's 13. Or we could add the 9 plus 1 first. That makes a 10. Then we can add the 3. We can move this 1 over to the 9 to make a 10. Then we can add the 3. That makes 13. The sum is the same. If we want to add 2 plus 3 plus 8, we can add the 2 plus 3 first and make a 5. Then we can add the 8. That'll be 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. We could also add the 2 from this side and the 8 all the way from this side together to make a 10. Then add the 3. And if we add the 2 and the 8, that's going to make a 10, 11, 12, 13. The sum is the same. We can add any two add-ins first. To add 5 plus 5 plus 2, we can add the 5 plus 5. That's doubles. That makes a 10. Then we can add the 2, 11, 12. We could add the 5 plus 2. That makes 7. Then we can add the 5. That makes a 12. It's the same number of counters. We haven't added or taken any away. It's the same add-ins. It doesn't matter the order that we add. We'll get the same sum. We can write three add-ends for the sum of these counters. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 counters here. And we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 counters here. We can put 6, and we can split these up. We can break it apart like that and make three add-ins. We can make a 4 and a 3. It's the same number of counters. We have 6 plus 4, that's 10, 11, 12, 13 counters. Here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 counters, and 1, 2, 3, 4 counters. We can split these up so we have three add-ins. We can put the 8 here, and we can split this into a 2 and a 2. Eight plus two will make a ten. Eleven, twelve. It equals twelve. Our next lesson, we're going to talk about adding three numbers and compatible numbers, where we can make tens or doubles. That's lesson three point eleven. I hope the video was helpful, and now you know we can add in any order, just like adding two add-ins. We could do that with three add-ins. We could do that with four add-ins. doesn't matter. The sum will stay the same. Have a great day, and I'll see you next video. Bye.